Hello and welcome back. Uh, and we're going to keep on collecting items in this town until we're very, very bored. Gold cash. Got all that. Uh, Bell's cash is available uh, as soon as you pick up the um, codex entry outside Lovering. Uh, where you rescue uh, Bowden Fennec, his son. And so you have. Anyway, um. Oh, good. Uh, son, the. The corpse of the Minifica. Talking about how the Templars should. Dread finding him and how he's hidden something in the circle tower. That's what he's talking about. Uh, well, just like you wanted. Yeah. Right. I must say it's really intriguing that I failed to unlock every single chest. I've been too busy trying to finish this area quickly. Which if anybody's uh, going to say I fell miserably, uh, I don't care. It's the effort that counts. What now? What well, now is we continue up the tower. It's so nice to have some interaction in the game. Not a word. Okay, okay, nothing, 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 nothing. Uh, onwards and upwards, and onwards and downwards and what's upwards. It's probably going to be a very, very long bit of climbing. But thankfully, it won't be as long as um, it was. As you desire. Uh, the first time we came, given the fact that we uh, don't have any dolls to do. But uh, actually, actually, I ignore what I just said. There is one bell. Right. Um, no, 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 no. That one. Okay. Yeah, it's one more than balance to that I leveled. And when are you going to give me that thingy? Thank you very much. Right. Right. That makes um, three because I was two. No. Was it three? No, I don't have time to go and look. Right. Oh, let me guess. I just found the codex uh, talking about the fraternities that what's his face talked about uh, The one that was talking with Niall at the very beginning of the game. Well, oh, beginnish. Beginningish. Right, next floor, clear out of collectibles. Oh, Zevran's uh, achievements. He contributed 1% to party damage. He's a hard worker. <laughs> okay. Uh, oh. Another. Uh, uh, what now? Uh, what now is we continue on with this floor? Yeah, these are the first three statues, if anyone remembers. I did them effortlessly. 
Horn of. All the things that I can say, Togoth never did. In fact, I wonder if these videos are actually uh, side by side with his videos. Hmm. Be interesting to find out, huh? But uh, probably not. There's a lot of walking done in this area, isn't there? Oh, Desire Demon with the Shiver. Oh. Oh. Shiver! One of the most irritating of the um, accessories. Gives you a cold resistance. I don't recall any uh, enemy that actually does um, cold cold attacks. However, it will remove one dexterity point. Uh, quite possibly the most useless of the accessories. Or, uh, I'm sure that there are probably someone somewhere out there that has played this game and probably could tell me an even more useless accessory. Which one is? If all were made tranquil, this would not have happened. No. Spoken like a true Templar lackey. People are split on this um, aspect of the, the story. Right. We've got two factions that are at heads with each other. We've got mages that there are some that would like freedom. Shield increases your defense rating and well, okay. um, Templars who want to control all mages. Mm. Well, probably more accurate Templars that are encouraged by the Chantry to control all mages. Now. I'm not entirely sure where I stand. I've uh, told the pro mages that think that it's wrong for Templars to control them uh, that this attitude uh, stems from the reason of the because of um, how it was with, under the Ant of Inter Imperium. I've told Pro Templars that not all mages are blood mages and to assume that any uh, apostate is a blood mage is uh, going too far. Now, um, I'm, I'm going to be honest here, I, I can see the reasoning behind both sides, however, there are some instances where I think uh, Templars go too far. Right. 
and at the same time I've seen mages who have made it so that more would um, see the Templars and the Chantry's side. Right, I haven't tempted the Harrowing Chamber, so I'll just go and finish that off and I can leave. Well, it took in a very long time. Oh, oh that's interesting. Okay. Um, there's something unusual about that room. Um, even though it hasn't happened here. Now, on many occasions I've beaten Aldred, but as it was as it is in this case as well, I didn't loot his body of any items. Attempt making sure that I don't um, have too many items in my inventory. Now, on occasion, when I returned later when I didn't have to worry about such things. Aldred had resurrected himself and we had to fight him all over again. It's a shame I did I wasn't able to show you um, this unusual event. Anyway, it's Almost time to finish off this video once the next uh, that's prison area is that's it. Yep, now that's started. I shall uh, finish the video here and start next time.